Today we're going to be taking a look at how bulletproof stickers can be and how many it takes to stop a bullet completely. Guys, we have stickers, which are apparently being applied to my arm right now. We give them out every once in a while at meet and greets and stuff. They've got the cool King of Random crown logo on them, and we wanted to do a test. We have got lots of these stickers, hundreds of them, and we are going to see how many it takes to stop a bullet. Here's the basic idea. We're going to take a bunch of stickers stacked up, and with three different guns, we're going to see how bulletproof they are. So we can stack them up in 100, and then if we decide that we're going to need more than that to stop one of these bullets, we can see just how many it's going to take. We also have a few different sizes of guns, so we can try a couple different things to see less powerful bullets and more powerful bullets. We've made these stacks of 100 stickers. That's about how thick they are, so just over a centimeter, I'd say. We've got lots of those, and we built this nice little jig that should nicely hold our stickers in place. So we're just gonna start by taking this 100 pack, putting it at the back, and seeing if we can shoot through it. We're gonna go with the lowest caliber we have. We're gonna use a 22 rifle. I think it'll get through that. 22s aren't very powerful as guns go, but I still think it'll get through this pack of 100 stickers. Here we go, first test, 100 stickers and using the 22 rifle. You guys ready? Yep. Firing. First shot, I hit the stickers and they launched up in the air somewhere. They're uh, back there. And they, they landed in the snow and I thought I saw where they landed, but when I went to try and find them, I couldn't. So we're gonna try this again and at least try and keep track of where they go. Shot number two. That went straight back. Well, the stickers went right here. Yeah. Wait, did 100 work? It might have. Oh no. I don't think there's an exit wound. Wait, there's a bullet. You caught a bullet I with 100 stickers. <laughs> he knocked the backboard right off. It's a 22, but I you still did. caught a bullet with 100 stickers. Here we go. <sighs> That's awesome. That is our bullet. And then here we've got stickers that I don't think they really got pierced by the bullet, but it like, it just broke Split from the force of the impact, it looks like. So this sticker is, is honestly like, I wouldn't have thought a sticker could get halfway, but like there's a tear in the front, but it's not torn all the way through at the back. So this got stopped by that last sticker. That's, that's the bulletproof sticker right there. And this is really interesting to me. Like it just hit this And it exploded, you can actually see where you screwed that into place. The, the back of this just tore right off. Yep, it broke right at the screws. We may be improvising our back because one more shot and that whole thing is gonna come off, I'm sure of it. So we'll just end up bracing it with some, like a two by four and some rocks. So we shot through nearly a hundred stickers with our 22 caliber. Now we're gonna try our handgun with 500. See how far we get. We are using a more powerful gun, and since we almost got through with the weakest gun, we're scaling it up. A lot more stickers. See how many we can get through. So each one of these little paper tabs represents where we're at 100. So we've got 500 stickers here. Three, two, one. <laughs> Landed right there. Uh, this is about half of them. These stickers don't have any bullet damage. I don't know where the rest went. Well, looks like we lost 200, so we can just put 200 back on. That's awesome. I think the bullet might have bounced out. Because here we have an impact yeah. and then where it stops. Like we've, we've stopped going through stickers at this point, but these ones, like I can see right through that yeah. one. There's a hole. <laughs> Hello. 
I can see you. You can't see me though. So yeah, we got through, uh, so that's I think 100. 200. That's about 100. And then I don't know how it escaped at the bottom, <laughs> but it did. The bullet is gone. Oh, I think I see the bullet. <laughs> right there. So I think it oh, went man. through and then the stickers pushed it enough. Okay, so maybe stickers aren't out. bullet proof, but they're bullet deflecting? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Ready? How many did you get through? At least a hundred. And then it was still working its way through the others when I think it got deflected again. Threw some stickers out the back of this piece of wood and I believe I see at least part of the bullet embedded in our two by four. Oh yeah, look at this. Check this out. Bullet scraped, bounced off the back. Holy cow. As it took off that direction. Well, this little handgun, and when I say little, I mean physically, the handle of the gun is quite small and hard to hold on to, is kind of hard to aim. So I think we're gonna upgrade one more time to a more powerful rifle that should be easier to aim well. All right, that is 1,000 stickers, all stuck together in like a sticker log. All right, and for this, we are gonna be using our AR-15, the most powerful gun we have here. We can get it to stay in our holder, which has been taking some bullet damage and... Uh, that'll, that should be fine. We have used a lot of stickers in an attempt to hold the rest of our stickers in place. I don't really think it's gonna do much against the power of a bullet. But it was really fun. Maybe it'll help a little. We'll see. Firing. Did I miss? <laughs> I'm not even 10 feet away. Those sights were lined up perfectly. I think I shot over it. I think it's sighted for like to be farther down range and I'm so close that I'm shooting right over it. All right, firing. And now it shoots high. <laughs> Bring me more bullets. Nailed it. Yes. Oh my gosh. Here's you... the crazy thing though. They shot out the back. Right through. There's our two bullet holes. So was this the back one then? I think so. They just got like smashed up against it. But yeah, I think that went, look at that. This actually held them in place pretty well. I think we shot through a thousand <laughs> stickers with this rifle. So you can see the two holes there, the two holes there. This was the, the back piece, I believe. But when we had that lined up right, that shot through 1,000 stickers. That kind of shows off the difference between the 22 and the AR-15. The 22 stopped by 100 stickers, whereas the AR-15 shooting 223 bullets got through a thousand. Like, I can clearly see right through that hole too. That actually is really cool. Like, I like that as a design. <laughs> nuts. Can a thousand stickers stop a bullet? Well, yes and no. It depends what bullet and what gun. 22 rifle, not so much. <laughs> The handgun didn't seem to get through more than about 250 stickers, but our rifle with the 223 ammo got through a thousand and carried on through the back. Goodness golly gee, it might have kept on going right through the 2x4 as well. Goodness that is. Goodness golly gee. Goodness golly gee, yes. Goodness golly gee. And most importantly, our sticker bridge. <laughs> actually <laughs> held our stickers in place but i think we should attribute it to the sticker bridge i i think the sticker bridge actually worked and it was hilarious because all the other ones went flying these stayed so can you fire through a thousand stickers yes you can does a sticker bridge hold it in place yes it does <laughs> oh that's hot that's hot Guys, that's not all. We've always got more for you to see. That box up at the top will take you to our last video. You should go check that out. The other box is gonna show you what YouTube thinks you should be watching next. And if you hit this bomb in the middle, you'll be subscribed to our channel and that way you'll never miss out on a video. Don't forget to ring that bell and we'll see you in the next one. Talk to you then.